Good morning, Minecraft gamers. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Fun with Flapjack Hardcore Minecraft. Actually, today I'm back in Samurai Server, and I am playing in a little village near uh, Yaw Creeper's uh, home base and uh, guild base and whatnot. Uh, we're hanging out over here, and it looks like we are getting slaughtered by raid after raid after raid after raid after raid, and I could go on saying raid after raid. We are in the middle of some sort of 1.14 glitcheroo. That's right. We're fighting these pillagers and illagers and uh, all the evokers and all the vindicators and all the nonsense endlessly. You can see Yaw Creeper with all the arrows in him. Um, yeah, man, we just are going to town on this stuff. And so I thought I would record it, you know, for about 10 minutes or so and see just how far along we might be able to make it in this gameplay. And man, it just doesn't end. And so I thought, yeah, what a good name. How long do pillager raids last in 1.14 Minecraft? Come on, Mojang. What in the world is going on in 1.14.2? We are struggling here. Yeah, okay, so this isn't uh, hardcore mode right now. We're in a hard mode server, and it's semi-vanilla and tons of fun to play. But uh, this is a nightmare, especially if you're the type of players that don't like to die a lot and you want to you know, enjoy the game and not get slaughtered endlessly and needlessly, uh, kind of like me. I enjoy playing the game, and I like all of the challenges that the game presents. And this is, of course, an extreme challenge, uh, just battling through these raids. At first, they're simple. When they start, they just send, you know, a handful of these raiders that attack a village, and they're, you know, trying to kill pillage. I mean, they're trying to kill villagers and pillage their buildings and destroy their beds and uh, kill off the villagers so that they can uh, be declared the winners. But yeah, if you defend the, the village from these raids, you're supposed to be able to get the achievement and get the effect of being the hero. But as you can see on the screen over and over and over while we're fighting through this endless battle, it just keeps loading raid after raid after raid. And there are dozens and it becomes... Uh, to a point for us fighting these things that there are dozens and dozens of these pillagers attacking this village. You can see y'all creeps over there uh, going to town on these guys. Man, I mean, we are just slaughtering them as much as we possibly can. But, you know, when you kill them off and kill them off and kill them off, and then here comes some more, and then here comes some more, and then here comes some more, and you're fighting like six or eight raid waves all at one time, uh, man, it just seems like there's no point for this. Uh, it's got to be a game bug, some kind of epic game bug in 1.14.2, because I don't recall this being an issue in 1.14 or .1, but yeah, in .2 it seems like this is uh, pretty common. I fought through a raid like this on my own for about two or three hours, and finally I just did not end the raid. I left one of the pillagers moping around and after a couple of hours the game just faded and the raids went away and it ended but you know you're supposed to be able to fight through these things and get the uh, hero award because you know you kind of want to be the hero who saves the day there's nothing wrong with that but yeah y'all creeping me we're just going to town on these guys and it doesn't end as soon as you complete one raid it just starts another raid and then when that raid's over it might start one or two more raids and uh, you're fighting pillagers and pillagers and pillagers and pretty soon you look like um, little human minecrafty pin cushions with all the arrows that uh, the crossbow shooters are sticking in you as they launch their arrows from their crossbows and and just uh, endlessly attack you it over and over and over now, on a positive side of this, uh, yeah, it's been a lot of fun, and I mean, there are a lot of emeralds laying around on the ground, but, you know, the negative is, just look at all of these pillagers and raiders that are attacking us over and over and over, and so, you know, you got to kind of jump up into the sky, get out of the way, and uh, maybe eat a little bit of steak on your way back down, to, uh, find a vantage point, which is my approach uh, when I fight 
you know, different raids and such, I like to land on top of a tree or a building where I am just slightly outside of the area where they're going to be able to lock target on me and start shooting me. And then I just spend my time slaughtering the enemy and taking them out. But uh, yeah, this just goes on and on. I think I've said that about a thousand times by now, but you get my point. Every single time we complete a raid it just seems like it sets up another raid and then two more raids and three more raids and you've seen the screen i mean it is just loaded with raids that are happening and yeah it, it got to be to a point of ridiculous and so we did a bit of a retreat and just stood back and started fighting from a distance to see what could happen and you know it just keeps loading you can see new raiders and uh, new captains of the guards with the banners and all of that i think at the end of all of this i don't remember because you know we fought through this uh about two days ago and then i haven't had time to get on and uh, edit the footage from recording this and all of that but uh yeah i think i end up with like a stack plus seven or so of those banners from the uh bad omen ominous banner effect and whatnot uh, for killing that captain of the guard and then at one point i think i end up with like bad omen level seven or eight on me and uh, pretty soon it does fade uh, one of the interesting things is if you're in the area where the raid loads and the new raid takes effect it'll wipe that bad omen effect off of you but uh yeah, so it's just basically me and Yaw Creeper in the server right now, uh, pretty quiet. And, you know, here's, yeah, I'm sitting at uh, Bad Omen 6 there. You can see I popped that up and looked at it. But, uh, anyways, <clears throat> so it's just Yaw Creeper and me that are just battling it out with all of these different raids. And uh, basically, the raids are pretty easy overall to fight through. I mean, you get into a glitch like this, it's just going on and on and on and on. That's pretty tough, but you do reach a point in the gameplay where, you know, you start defeating a lot of the raiders and picking up a ton of emeralds and uh, the evokers show up. And once the evokers get into the fight, that's where you really got to be cautious if you don't like dying. Uh, you know, none of us, I think, None of us enjoy dying in this game, but if you're trying to avoid dying at all, then when the evokers show up, they start summoning the Vex into the, the raid battles. And if you've got six raids going and evokers are showing up in each one of those raids, you're dealing with uh, two or three evokers in each raid times like five or six. So you could have 15, close to 20 evokers out there and then multiply that by three because... Each evoker is going to be summoning in like three vex when they summon the vex to attack you. And so, I mean, you're looking at uh, five, four, five, five or six dozen vex attacking you, you know, over 60 vex at one time. And then if they summon more, it just stacks. And <laughs> pretty soon you're just dealing with nothing but those little swarming mosquito vex issues and the vex are ferocious in hard mode uh, hard and hardcore mode the vex have an incredible amount of damage they can deal when they hit you with the sword uh, and if you're wearing an elytra you're already debuffed on your uh, maximum defense levels and so if three or four of those vex hit you all at once and you don't happen to be carrying a totem of undying you're probably just gonna uh join the the other side and uh be pushing up daisies isn't that right you're gonna be down in the grave before you know it uh yeah i seem to have lost my ability to hit what i'm shooting at um i'm hitting that building more than i'm hitting anything else but uh i think i went through i don't know about a thousand arrows uh, fighting through this raid with uh, creeper over there but uh, man we just we just didn't you know we didn't give up we just kept trying and trying and fighting and and you know collecting up some of the goods and you know doing what we could to fight our way through this but uh, yeah man you get too many of these vindicators hitting you with those overpowered stone axes they run around with or 
you know, I think they're stone. They might have iron. I don't recall. But, uh, yeah, man, you get hit by these big beasties that are trying to chew your face off. And then you got these evokers running around, summoning Vex. And then you've got Vindicators slaughtering you, chopping on you, cutting off your, your feet and your arms. And um, witches tossing poison potions at you. And it just is endless. But, uh, yeah, we clear out that wave and then here comes another wave we cleared out that wave and you can see up on the screen it's reloading a new wave and so that wave's attacking us again um it just goes on and on and on and so you reach a point you know where hey come on man enough's enough let's just uh find ourselves a little safe spot and recalibrate retool maybe re-engage uh, from a different perspective yeah i jumped down on top of a rooftop here and started fighting and it was drawing quite a bit of their attention into my direction and uh, I was hoping to help uh, Creeper out a little bit so he could get over there and pick up his gear. Uh, he's been down there doing uh, melee combat, hand, you know, hand to hand, sword to face and, and all of that good stuff. But uh, yeah, at the end of the day, this is just ridiculous Mojang. Mojang, I like to say. Uh, Mojank, you Mojanky, you Mojanked it up on us there, boys. Fix your crap. And so anyhow, this is probably a common issue that others are dealing with in other servers. And I kind of just wanted to share with you uh, the battle that Creeper and I were dealing with a couple days ago because this was insane. You can see down there, I've got it in fast forward. You can imagine how long this battle was taking place if this video is only like 10 or 12 minutes long and uh, we're down here fighting and slaughtering and killing in fast forward mode. Yeah, I think it's 4x, so four times the amount of time we fought for Epa. But uh, yeah, at the end of the day, we didn't give up. We just uh, gathered up all the goods and kind of did a uh, retreat to see if there's some way to solve this endless uh, raid glitch cycle. But I really don't know. Short of maybe getting a hold of the server owner and having all of the pillagers and whatnot killed or you know, maybe the server owner can get in there and mess with the settings or something. I sure don't know. But uh, yeah. I just wanted to give a good shout out to Yaw Creeper and say, hey man, good job, good fight. I know you lost some gear there and it sucked really bad and trying to work in this village and, and get it all set up is a real bummer when you got to deal with endless amounts of raids, but uh, hang in there, buddy. Uh, we're the heroes, not the zeros, and we didn't give up the fight. So if you're dealing with something similar to what Yaw Creeper and I dealt with, hang in there, fight the good fight and don't give up and you can win in the end. That's right, you're the hero.